But what's up, gamers? We lit, man. We got an extra two days off, man. Let's fucking go. VTO kicked in. I'm spitting and everything like I'm a fucking lizard. But y'all, like, I'm excited. We got an extra day off, man. I'm cooling right now in the food line parking lot. I always tell myself I'm not going to do this. I'm just going to go straight in and get what I need, but I end up cooling. So I like to let my car warm up, and it feels good in here, and it's cold out there, even though I enjoy the cold. On top of that, there also seems to be a lot more people in this parking lot this morning than I expected. So I was like, why not record a YouTube video? In other news, I was at work two or three days ago, and let me tell y'all something, man. Lifting up packages and spicy food does not mix at all. Do not eat spicy food unless you're young, like super duper young. Like if you're like 13 or 14 or some shit and you're going to work or like even 16 or 17, you know, that's when like, you know, you can eat anything. Like you look at kids and shit, like seven or eight year olds and you're like, damn, they can just eat anything and like their stomach doesn't bother them. As you get older though, your stomach starts getting fucked up. Y'all. Do not eat spicy food and then think you're going to go to work for 10 hours and lift up packages, man. Not a good combo. Let me tell you, I bought these two bowls from Food Line, right? These two bowls that had like this spicy buffalo chicken and shit in it. Then for some reason, I, on top of that, I also cooked some rice and put some hot sauce on the rice, man. Tell me why I was lifting up like this heavy package and I was about to stow it. And I felt like a fart. Like, you know how, like, when you're about to fart, it feels like a fart? And you're like, okay, I'm certain. Statistically speaking, there's a 75% chance this is a fart. So there's still that other percent chance, right, that it might not be a fart. But you're just like, you know what? I think this is a fart. And then right when the fart's about to come out, you can tell it's going to be a shit, like a, a wet one. You're like, holy hell. Like, this is not good at all. This is not cash money. This fucking dude looking at me in the parking lot, man. I was, bro, I need to get my windows tinted. It's just like, motherfuckers just don't know how to mind it. Maybe, you know what? Maybe it's also being introverted. Have y'all felt that? Maybe it's also being introverted as well. Because he looked like a Discord admin, too. Motherfucker looked like a damn Discord admin. Motherfucker, neck beard. But, um, well, that's a nice Tesla. But, y'all, maybe, that, maybe that's me. Maybe it's because I'm extremely introverted. And I don't really fuck with, like, nobody at all. I've got, like, one friend, but, like, that I know in real life. And it's just, like, I'm just looking at me. Like, you know what? Maybe it's because it's not anxiety. I'm not going to say I have anxiety, but y'all ever noticed that, like, you in a room and you feel like everyone's paying attention to you? But no one, like, obviously no one really is, right? No one's, like, you're not that important unless you're a celebrity or something. Then everyone is looking at you and screaming at you and shit. But it just feels like that, you know? Like, I'd just be walking up, like, especially at, Am at Amazon, though. Amazon is different. I swear, I, c I can swear it's different. Amazon, you up in this warehouse all day with these random-ass niggas and shit. Amazon's just built different, bro. Like, all these niggas just don't know how to mind their business. And, and they all looking at you and shit. They, they all just staring at you. Now, he looking at me, so I looked at him right back. Like, motherfucker. But, 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 like... Y'all, like, and Amazon, it'd be different, man. Motherfuckers just be staring at you for no reason, bro. Staring at you for no reason at all. And I just be like, holy shit, that woman, that woman almost hit me. And I just be like, bro, like, come on now. This is outrageous. Like, how many people? But look, maybe it's just me, though. Let me know in the comments below. I know I'm saying random shit. But let me just let me know in the comments below, y'all. I swear, I swear. I swear people just be like, or maybe you just end up making eye contact with them at the same exact time or something like that. Maybe that's what it is. And it's just like, yo, why are all these fucking people looking at me, son? But, but anyway, y'all back to what I was saying. So I had those two Buffalo, those hot bowls, right? Those two Buffalo bowls, brother. And I had that rice with the hot sauce on it. Jesus, I Christ. I mean, I tell you one thing. I went to lift up that package. Like I said, 75% chance. That um, it was going to be, you know, a sh like a not a shit, just a fart. Twenty five percent chance that it was going to be a a shit. So I took the risk, and it, that that probability flipped completely. Because right when the fart was about to go out, like you know, you feel that little feeling, that liquid feeling in your stomach, and I was like, oh my god. And for a second, I thought I let a little bit of the fart out, which means I let a little bit of the shit out. 
And I was like, oh my God. Bro, if I just shit myself, I cannot leave this section. Like, that's what I thought. I was like, if I just shit myself, I cannot leave this little section that I'm in because obviously people are gonna know based on the shit sliding down my, my uh, jean shorts and on my leg that I shit myself, right? And I was like, damn, if I did shit myself, and I was afraid to turn around and look on the floor because I was like, oh my God, what happens if like it's on the floor and shit? Like I just, eventually someone's gonna come into my aisle and ask me if I need help or someone's gonna come into my aisle, you know, we switch aisles consistently. Something's gonna end up happening. That is going to cause me to, you know, someone to notice, right? But alas, I turned around and there was no shit on the floor, guys and girls. Highly doubt women watch this. But, you know, I was like, this is good. This is great. This is the news I wanted to hear. This is the energy that I wanted. And I was able to go to the bathroom and I took like three or four shits at work that day, man. Like, it was just consecutive back-to-back -back shits. Back-to-back, -back, like, Drizzy's diss tracker against Meek Mill a couple years ago. It was back-to-back -back like that. And I was like, holy shit, man. This is horrible. Never again. So the moral of this story is do not eat spicy food and then go to work. Don't do it. Do not do it. Unless you have an Iron Man fucking stomach and you can just tank a whole bunch of shit. Or, you know, you're just, like, living on the edge. Don't do it, man. Because I don't know what I would have done if I would have shit right there on the floor. I don't know. I probably would just quit. I probably would just quit. I would just walk out of the aisle in utter embarrassment. And then after that, like, I would just be like, go up to the manager and be like, yeah, I'm sorry, I quit. And just walk out. Before he, like, noticed. He'd be like, what's that on your leg? And I would just walk out before he could, like, find out what's actually in the aisle, which is a lot worse, right? Other than that, y'all, yeah, that's it. I got two days off today, so I'm going to be working on my uh, my online stores and stuff like that. And yeah, good day. Let me know in the comments below, y'all, what y'all thought of this story and the whole entire people staring at you thing. And uh, I will catch y'all in the next video. Maybe I'll make a video tomorrow since I'm off tomorrow, too. Who knows? Maybe, just maybe, if y'all want to follow me, make sure you... I, I never say that in my videos. Hit that sub button and hit that like button for the YouTube algorithm. Oh, fucking shit. I can't even talk. I sound like fucking one of those hag ravens off of Skyrim after you beat the shit out of it and take its fucking soul gem, man. Um, make sure you subscribe and hit that like button for the YouTube algorithm so that way my video can be shown and other people can know about my almost diarrhea shits at work and Amazon. So, yeah. Um, catch you on the next video, man.